This battlefield is perfect. It reeks of carnage, blood, and despair. I just realized I was super... My audio was super low. I don't know how long it's been super low. That's kind of cringe. Anyways, I said, welcome back. Game number two. I'm playing Nemesis again. We're doing the yellow Numby build. A good matchup against AMC because he has no way of getting my, my shield off other than uh, damaging through it or waiting it out. And like I said before, which you didn't hear, neither of those are good options. They both kind of fucking blow. So, good for me. Vibin? I am just going to do this probably. Your attacks are meaningless. Nice, I got the blue buff. Uh he does not have mannequins, so he doesn't win this fight. He actually has no chance in this fight. He did use his meditation, which did give him a bit of HP back, but not nearly enough to win the fight or go for the red buff. And like I said just there, with him having to damage through my shield, makes it very good for me. I feel very in control of this matchup right now. Which I should be. Now here's the hard part. Hopefully he doesn't kill me while I'm doing this buff. My back is turned. Didn't. Fog him. Right. Way. Probably are going to do my blue. I don't care that much. I lied. I want it. You're not level 5. I'm not scared of you. You have no mana. You have no meditation. Why would I be scared of you? I saw my relic too. Oop. There it is. He got my blue, but he died for it. And I got the other two buffs and didn't die for it. So... That is a very, very good start. I can almost afford my first yellow numby item. Um, he's not level 5 yet, but he will clear my wave and get level 5 and then probably try to kill me. So come to think of it, this is like kind of a bad idea to stay this long, but whatever. It is what it is. I'm just going to back now. And I'll wait to 50 gold. I don't care about my tower. Your middle tower is under attack. Let's be honest, tower does like six damage. No point in giving a shit about it. I can feel the <clears throat> All right. Good stuff. Good stuff so far. Now, he doesn't have sprint, which means if I alt him, he's slow as hell forever. But I am going to need pressure to do that because I can't, I can't fight him into an entire minion wave. That's just not how life works. Right now... You pushed up a little bit too far. And you are deceased. Maybe? No, you're fast enough, actually. Crazy. It's actually crazy that he's fast enough with my alt and my two on him. I mean, I know the, the slows don't stack, I'm pretty sure, but... Still, they're both really strong slows. So it's kind of nuts to me that he can just walk away from it. But I was also auto-attacking, so I guess it makes sense. On right, my next item, uh, just like in game one, gonna be the same in game two, Mystical Mail. And yeah, I have to be exactly 0% scared of him. Yeah, I can just... Whenever I use my shield, I just... First off, I clear the wave so easy with my yellow numbies. And secondarily... Um... There's just almost nothing he can do about it. I actually do want the blue. I don't care too much for the red, because... I'm not really going for kills here. I'm going for sustainability. Like, being able to do that guarantees me so much farm. I really want to know how... I want to know if I can even use the first game at all. Like, was my audio bad the entire time? I will kill you. If you look over here. Okay. 
Okay, okay, okay. Kind of outplayed me, I'll be honest. Please don't kill me. Please stop. My Okay. So he gets red buff, but I mean, I still get two. I get I get two buffs, and he gets one. Granted, I didn't kill him this time, so it's not as good for me, but it's definitely not bad. And the reason that fight went so poorly for me is because he altered my dash, and um, him altering my dash meant that after I altered him, I couldn't actually get close enough to drag out. But it's okay. He's definitely maxing his three. I can smell the souls. 100% maxing his three. Okay. Why are you the way that you are, though? Okay, he ulted me to get me away, but I... I never even ulted him there. This is a free ult, and he didn't pick it up either, so... He's gonna, he's gonna be a little bit depressy-messy about that one. Did he get the, uh... The minions over here? Yeah, that two only hit me for 80. Definitely maxing the... Oh. Man, it is... Very difficult. Up with him. Hmm. Mystical male is a thousand and fifty gold. Tier three. Your bones will shatter. All right. Your middle tower. And I now have the male. I would love for him not to get that blue. Oh, he's just already there. I couldn't get there in time if even if I wanted to, and I did want to. But with Mystical Mail, that's going to give me a ton of extra damage. It's going to be... Actually, Mystical Mail is going to be probably most of my damage when I'm next to him. Could just do Bull Demon, probably. I don't know if my DPS is high enough to quote-unquote just do Bull Demon, but... Fuck it, why not? Wow, it's horrendous. Which is why I'm gonna stay and try it. Now, nobody in their right mind would do this, so I doubt he's gonna come over here. Probably just gonna try to take my tower. To add to my collection. Your middle tower is under attack. Leave you oh. can. Yeah, you definitely don't win this one. I'm just gonna let Mystical Mail do its thing. There we go. Yeah, Mystical Mail did 500 damage in that fight. Like I said, I know, like... I know it's super weird to say out loud that Mystical Mail is gonna be one of my highest damage outputs, but... It just straight up is. Like... <laughs> I just know the game enough to know that with this build, Mystical Mail is going to be kind of my go-to for DPS. All right, so we're going to go there and we're going to go probably Crusher here. I like the Crusher play and I also like the Thorns play. He's going to go Sprint 100%. This is not even, not even uh, debatable. Sprint's just the best pickup for him. Beads could work as well, but like Sprint is just the best pickup. All right, you have my blues up. It is. All right, so the risky play of Bull Demon actually did pay off. Don't be afraid. Hit me. Leave All right. If you can. I still did about half his HP there. I am 100% down the dive tower here.
Unlucky. Not enough damage. However, I will probably get tower. I will definitely get tower. And I'll get his blue buff too. Nice. So even though I didn't kill there, I got a lot from that fight. I got a ton from that fight. I might be able to just straight up buy Crusher now. Yeah, I can. Okay, that was that was actually a I huge bonus. He should be he should be really scared now. Now that I have Crusher, I have a little bit more attack speed. I have more yellow numbies. You should be scared. Uh, I don't have alt, so you don't really have to be that scared. But once I get alt, you should. Second relic. Shell. I mean, that's weird. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. Shell's bad. Well, it's not bad, but there's definitely better. I'm going to stand in this. I want to heal. I'm glad that he was scared enough of me to just run away when I dashed at him because I didn't have my three up or my ult up. I was just, I just, I was trolling. I, I mean, seriously. Hello? Okay. Um, that was actually pretty good. I mean,. It would have been much better if he didn't get to pick up his, his stinger. But when he ulted me, I should have just ran away. Me chasing after him was a little bit a little bit dotish. Not doing bold demon. When I go silent like that, by the way, I'm just listening to see what they're doing. You can. Okay. I took zero damage there, pretty much. And he lost his ult. <clears throat> I don't know why he did that. Alright, so my next two items, by the way, are going to be Odysseus Bow, which I'm building now. And Kinsize. Does yellow numbies, of course. Hit me. And we are back to full HP. We're gonna auto attack this wall to simulate the sound of auto attacks, so he might get scared and think that I'm hitting Phoenix or Bull Demon. I'm moving because that's normally what you do. I just want to blue off. Okay, thanks. No thanks. I'd rather you not have that. Obo, how much? 1450? I can actually get that after this wave. Perfect. And then I'll just go grab Obo and then I'll I'll start slamming the bull demon. And keep in mind, he does have better secure than me. I'm not I'm not delusional, right? I understand. Even two levels down, he does more burst damage than I do with his all two combo, because I can't alt a bull demon. So he could very easily steal this. That being said, dude, look at my yellow numbies. It's honestly amazing. That being said, I think I have to do it anyways. Because it's very hard for me to actually commit to him. And like, okay, you really, so oh, this is what we're doing? I think I'm just going to go back and do it. Oh, you know what? <clears throat> I should do red buff first. I should do red first for sure. Alright, red 
buff. He thinks healing is the problem. He thinks my healing's the problem with my three up. It's not even the heal that's that's the problem with three. It's the fact <laughs> that my three is a 420 HP shield. Like I don't even if I don't heal at all, it's just an extra 420 HP. That's cracked. All right, go back over here. Just mess around with Bull Demon. I could just maybe stand in front of Bull Demon. I want to pull it out here. Nice. Nice. The mystical male. The mystical male, the thorns, the mannequins, and the oboe. Look at that. All my yellow numbies just actually followed him around and killed him. Let's go. Let's go, yellow numbies. Let's go, yellow numbies. Massive. Actually massive. You will get nothing from me. He's going more defense. Good thing I'm going kins and I don't care about defense. Because my ult shreds and takes 30% of it. Um, okay. I guess I'll just back here. Oh, no, I'm not. And in there looking all, looking all fresh. Looking all ripe for the pickings. Okay, he's running away. He's running away. Kins is 2100, right? I can just back and get a full ass Kins. That's nuts. <clears throat> I I do kind of want to wait. Not spend all the gold and wait and get the mannequins upgrade, but honestly, with him going double defense right out the gate right now, I'm just I'm cool with it. Hey, there we go. Like, even if I'm not healing at all, getting that HP shield to just sit in his damage and kind of kind of AFK, really, like just not even play the game, just sit in his damage and ignore the fact that he's there. It's so crazy. So strong. Dude, look at those numbies. Bro, all of the yellows. All the yellows. Just so much yellows. Dude, look at that. All my damage. All my damage is tick damage except autos. Mannequins, thorns, kins, mystical, crusher, oboe. That's the perfect yellow numbies build. You literally could not get a better yellow numbies build than that. Oh, man. I'm proud. I'm proud of game two. I'm proud of game two, not because I played well, like the matchup plays itself, honestly, but the fact that we got the full yellow Numbi build online and it was all of my top damage, like the entire yellow Numbi list was all my top damage. Everything else was just autos. Not my two, not my alt, not my dash, just autos and yellow Numbies. What a, what a perfect, what a perfect ending to this video. <laughs> Anyways. Hope you guys enjoyed this yellow numbies build. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget every sub that I get on YouTube in the entire year of 2022. I will be donating 10 cents per sub to a charity. So that means 10 subs, $1, 100 subs, $10, so forth. <laughs> on is how it is. Um, Yeah, I appreciate you guys. And until yeah. next time, peace.